How's it going my friend? Squizzy here, and I'll be showing you how to catch a ton of Charcadets as well as how to evolve your Charcadet easily into Armor Rouge and Cerule Edge. Let's jump right into it. In the Paldean Pokedex, it states that Charcadets live in many parts of Paldea. In fact, according to the map, that's roughly about 80% of the whole region. But it also states that it's very rarely seen in these locations. That is true, and it could be stressful at times to not find the Pokemon you want, so let's go ahead and fix that right up. If you want to catch a Charcadet in your playthrough as early and as soon as possible, there's a good location here. Every time I've checked this spot, he is indeed here. So you want to go to this location on the map, and you want to head north from South Province Area 3 Watchtower, into this little alcove. This is the early way of finding him, so if you need a better way to find him in the late game, I have you covered. Don't worry about it. Let's take a look at that right now. In this method of finding Charcadet, you'll find what seems like an infinite amount. First, we'll set up a picnic, and then we're going to make a beautiful sandwich. This sandwich is going to be one of the default ones called the Pickle Sandwich. After your sandwich is made, as you can see on the top right corner, the second power we have is Encounter Power Fire. That is all you need to run into all these Charcadets. After you're done scarfing down your delicious sandwich, go to this location on your map. This is located just east of the Porto Marinata and Colonnade Hollow fast travel points. What you're going to want to do here is travel along this rocky ridge looking out for Charcadets. And I guarantee you, there will be a ton. Let's take a quick look at what I found. So just like I said, run across this rocky ridge and keep your eyes peeled for Charcadets. That's number two, three, four. That's already four, we're looking good. Number five. Oh, little dry spell here. That's all right. Six. Seven. Eight. Yeah, you just keep going across this path. Nine. Ten. You know, this is a good way to shiny hunt these things, too, just in case you were wondering. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Anyway, there's a bunch here. I just thought I'd show that to you guys. If you're playing Scarlet version, and after you capture your Charcadet, head to this location on your map. It's just south of the Artisan West fast travel point. Go to this location, and it'll be right around the ruins. Here we'll be gathering 10 Bronze Ore fragments from Bronze Ores to trade to a man that's going to give us the evolutionary item in return. As you can see, you could just use the Auto Battle Let's Go feature and knock 10 out really quick, probably just take a couple minutes, and we'll be done here. If you're playing Pokemon Violet version, on the other hand, head to these ruins located here on the map, just east of the Alphornada fast travel point. Here you'll find a ton of Synesties to KO, and altogether you'll want 10 Synesty chips just like the people playing Pokemon Scarlet version want 10 Bronze Ore Fragments. Go ahead and just use the Let's Go Auto Battle feature and you should be done with this in a couple minutes. After you've collected all 10 of your items, let's head to Zapapico East. Here you'll find an older gentleman standing next to a fountain, basically in the center of town, waiting to trade you your evolutionary item. In return, he wants your 10 Bronze Ore Fragments from Pokemon Scarlet, or your 10 Synesty chips from Pokemon Violet. In Pokemon Scarlet, he'll give you a set of Auspicious Armor, which will evolve your Charcadet into Armor Rouge, and in Pokemon Violet, he'll give you a set of Malicious Armor, which will evolve your Charcadet into Cerule Edge. After that, simply use your Evolutionary item on your Charcadet, just like you would an Evolutionary Stone. I'm playing Pokemon Scarlet version, so my Charcadet's going to evolve into Armor Rouge using the Auspicious Armor. And again, if you're playing Pokemon Violet version, using the Malicious Armor on Charcadet will evolve him into the better evolution, Cerule Edge. Yeah, so if anybody wants to trade me a Cerule Edge from your Violet version, I would be more than... Never mind, never mind. I can't even afford Nintendo Online. <laughs> Anyway, that about wraps it up, my friends. If you enjoyed this, or if it helped you out in any way, consider hitting the like button, as it does help out immensely. Comment down below, even if it's just for the algorithm, and subscribe to stay up to date with what I have going on. I've been Squizzit, and I'll catch you in the next one. Take care.